Hi, I'm Sharon Bill. Welcome to my Music Theory Tuition Series. It's coming up to exam entry time. If you're looking to enter to take the ABRSM Grade 4 exam, I'd like to help you on your way. To date, I've 82 videos uploaded to my channel to help you in your studies. The link to the playlists will be in the cards and also in the description box. Uh, first of all, you must work your way through the ABRSM Music Theory and Practice Workbook. Do remember that this is an accumulative series, so this also requires you to work through all of Grade 1, all of Grade 2, all of Grade 3, and also all of the information in Grade 4. But don't worry, I've worked through every single step of this with you. In my theory tuition videos, I work through every single exercise with you and I explain how to understand everything you need for the exam. On my website, I also provide some free PDF information sheets with information to accompany every step along the way. If you visit SharonBill.com, you can download these PDFs in A4 or US letter and each section of the PDF corresponds to a section in the workbook. For example, if you open your workbook up, the first exercise is introducing some new time signatures. I've referred to this in the videos and the book here is section A and the PDF document has section A and all of the information that you need for that section can be found there and that continues throughout the book and then also I work through every exercise with you and explain how to understand the material so that you can come to the correct answers yourself. So by all means do go to the playlist and work through that book with me. From 2018 onwards, ABRSM have revised the exam syllabus and I'll just show you which sections are affected. And so, um, the first thing will be um, either the four bar rhythms on page 20 you are no longer required to answer that at all. It used to be that there was um, that or a choice between the four bar rhythms or the writing a rhythm to words, which is page 29. If I just find that for you. So that used to be a choice between uh, writing a melody, uh, sorry, a rhythm to words or writing a four bar rhythm. Neither of those sections will crop up on the exam, so you don't need to do those for exam purposes. I've done a quick video on each of these just showing you the general principles but you're not required to complete those in the exam so you don't need to know that for exam purposes. So I've just quickly skipped over that in the videos. And then if you turn to the end of the book, the performance directions, now this still is information that you need to know but it's now presented to you in a multiple choice format. So from 2018 onwards, these performance directions will be multiple choice only. And don't forget that this is accumulative with um, all of grade one, two, three, and four multiple choice answers. Um, sorry, yes, all multiple choice questions, um, but you'll need to know all of those lists are cumulative. And so I've put um, a few PDFs at the end. So section L, I've given you some general information on instruments. And then I've also given you some revision techniques on all of your performance directions. And I've given you the opportunity to just test yourself to see how you're going in your revision. I've also written an exam technique guidebook where I give you tips and hints on how to best prepare for your exam and also how to make the best use of your time on exam day when you're actually working through your exam paper and details of how to find that can be found at my website. So again, if you go to SharonBill.com, you'll find it all there. Past papers are an excellent revision resource and I've worked through many of the previous year's past papers too. I'll put up a further video quickly guiding you through how to uh, use that resource there. The links to get you started on all of my video tuition will be in the cards and also in the description or you can find everything you need through my website so if you visit SharonBill.com you'll find it all there. I hope you enjoy your studies, I'm certainly enjoying working through it with you. 
if you can give me a like that would be really fab and please do subscribe to stay in touch there's lots more to come thanks for watching and i'll see you next time bye